Welcome to Grizz Practice, where we're here with one of the nine newcomers on the team. Very excited to have Cam Parker here on campus. And Cam, uh, we're just over a week away from the season. Before we get there, we got to go back. Tell me about your decision-making process to come to Montana, because it was a bit unique. You couldn't come here to visit, and then I, I know you were very sought after. It was kind of watching it wind down to a couple schools. So just tell us why Montana and everything that went with it. Uh, I picked Montana just because of the, the recent history that they've had, you know, making some commitments for a tournament multiple years, and uh, it's a lot closer to home. I've been on the East Coast for the last three years now, and because of the whole COVID situation, I wanted to be a little bit closer to home. And, you know, Coach Trav has the uh, assist record here, and I have the assist record at my old school, and uh, I can really learn a lot from him, you know, just from him being a point guard and me being a point guard. It's always room to develop, and uh, he's definitely taught me a lot in a little bit of time that I've been here. So. For you, before we start your Grizzly career, we have to go back. Because we're with an NCAA record holder here. You had 24 assists yep. in a single game. Take us back through that moment of, of what it was like maybe being in the zone, finding teammates, and then maybe the aftermath of it, knowing you broke a record and everything that came along with it. Yeah, I think my uh, coach and my teammates told me that I had like 15 or 16 assists at, at halftime. And I asked them what the record was. And they said it was 22. And I was like, hey, I could, I could get a couple more assists. So. Uh, I was happy that I was able to get to 24, and uh, Trey Young had a record at 22, so that's a big name to beat. Uh, and my phone was blowing up after, and you know I was getting texts from a lot of people, and I even got the little ESPN notification that said I broke this this record. So uh, it felt it felt really good, and I was just happy that we were able to get the win. That would have been that would have felt bad if we would have lost that game. Well, we cannot wait to see Cam dish out some dimes here in Missoula as well. Final question for you as far as what you can bring to this team this year and just maybe the excitement that is coming up for the game in the season. It's only just a week and a half away. Yeah, but I think that I can bring a, a lot of leadership. We have a lot of new guys and a lot of young guys. So between me, Cam Satterwhite, and Matt, we're kind of the only juniors uh, and Darius Henderson out the group. So just teaching these young guys and just being more of a vocal leader for the guys who haven't played college basketball or have played only a couple limited minutes. So just being a leader and then, of course, my passing and being able to uh, find guys and facilitate. And, uh, man, I really want to make it to the tournament. That's something that I haven't done in my two years of playing college basketball. So if we could do that and win a big star championship, no matter what my stats will be, I'll be happy to just get the ring. I think that sounds good <laughs> to all of us out there. Cannot wait to watch Cam Parker on the floor. Grizzly basketball starts next week at USC.